foundational to this decision in the mind of the president uh, was the commitment that every commander in chief makes with every single member of our armed forces, which is that we will not, them le we will not leave them behind uh, and we will not leave a member of the United States armed forces in the hands of the enemy. Uh, and the president uh, sees an opportunity that the United States had, a near-term opportunity, to secure the release of Sergeant Bergdahl, uh, and that's what the president did. Uh, and that is, something, that is something that the president stands by, because this is an enduring American value that predates this president, uh, and this is a value that will remain in place for future commanders-in-chief as well. Is there any reconsideration of that major statement that was made by the president in coming out with Bo Bergdahl's parents to announce that swap in the Rose Garden? We know that comes, that's a huge statement for the president to make. The, the, the optics of that, the message that sends in light of these charges, was that a mistake? Uh, the message that was sent is that this president, like previous presidents, fully subscribes, without exception to the theory, to the principle, to the value, that the commander-in-chief will not allow a, a member of the United States Armed Forces to be left behind. Uh, and it was important, an important message for the, this president to, deli to deliver to the American people, uh, but also to people all around the world, uh, that the United States and their commander-in-chief uh, stand squarely behind our men and women in uniform uh, and with the commitment that we have made to not, uh, to not leave them behind.